So this is my review of uh, Castlevania 1 on the Famicom. Um, in terms of the normal difficulty, it's not really that different from the North American release or uh, again, I can't really review European ones because I don't own a Nintendo. But in terms of the anniversary collection, um, but they it does have one thing that the that the overseas version didn't have. That is the easy setting. Basically, this makes the game very much easier. For example, you don't jump back if you get attacked by an enemy, and it's overall just uh, very. Basically, you don't take much hit either way. For example, you don't take four hits, you take two hits or something. So this makes the game uh, very easy for people who are used to the frustration. This is actually very good if you don't want the frustration aspect. So you can actually beat this game very easily. I only think I've I lost once, but that, that, that was because um, uh, I kind of got unlucky with the timer and I kind of screwed up. But yeah, I kind of <laughs> a little ashamed that I lost there, but uh, because the bad hardcore player wouldn't do that. But <laughs> but yeah, that's I think that was was like the only play I actually lost was against Death or Grim Reaper, basically, yeah, on easy mode. But yeah, um, but basically, this is a very much uh, less frustrating that than a normal setting. So yeah. It's very interesting to check out if you uh, want to try it out, but um, I guess the same rating would really be for the, I don't know, what was it, 10 out of 10, I think. Uh, I think that was the rating for the for the Castlevania 1 review, but that would be my rating here. Same rating, really. It's a good game. 10 out of 10.